Every time I wake up into this reality, every time I wake up from my slumber, it just feels like I'm waking up to, uh, a, 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 I don't know, a figment or something, um, I don't know, something fake. It seems like I'm waking up to a, 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 fi- a fake world or a figment world, I would say, um, it's like I'm plugging back into the matrix for some odd reason. Now, I don't know what I'm feeling right now, but I just feel like it just feels like I'm plugging back into the matrix. Every time I wake up from my slumber for some odd reason, it's like, OK, how do, how do I even know that I'm alive or or how do I even know that I'm dead or if I'm dead or how do I how do I even know if I have died already? Sometimes I feel like I may have died already or something i don't know you know um and and who 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 knows when they die right who knows sometimes i sometimes i i feel like i've died or have died or are dying in the past of course um you know these are the things i think about especially when it comes to life life and death i'm sorry by the way i know i kind of started this on some uh <laughs> um it is it is October eighteenth, two thousand twenty four. By the way, but yeah, it's just like how do I know everything that I wake up to is real? It just seems so. I don't know. It just seems like you know if anybody watched the Matrix movie or saw the Matrix movie, the first one I should say, um, it just seems like we're plugging back into something that isn't real. The food that we eat, the uh. The things that we touch, the things that we see out here just seems all figmatized. Like I'm plugging back into a digital world or something. I don't know. I, I'm, in, I'm, inside, I'm inside some sort of uh, game or something. I don't know. You know, it's just, it's just what, what seems real is, is when I go to sleep and dream and whatnot you know maybe maybe uh maybe revelations will happen maybe um maybe john's visions and revelations will happen but not in this timeline not in this world it'll happen in 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 in, in the dream world in in the spiritual world i would say or, or I should say the real world, you know, sometimes we may feel like this is the real world. I don't, feel, it just seems like this world isn't real. This world I wake up to is what I'm saying. Maybe the real world is in our subconscious. Maybe, you know, maybe that's what's real. I don't know. Sometimes I just, I don't know. If you, I don't even know what I'm asking. You know, it's, it's just, how do I know I'm even alive? How do I know I'm even alive? Maybe I'm dead in someone else's reality. Maybe I'm dead in someone else's world, someone else's reality. In a, in an alternate universe, I don't know. Is is there an alternate universe? There might be. Um You know, that's where I'm at right now. Just trying to trying to think like, you know, maybe I'm thinking too much. Maybe, you know, I I know I'm a thinker. I'm a free thinker too. I mean, nobody's going nobody's going to tell me how to think and and what to think. I'm a free thinker. So I'm going to think broader. I'm going to think and expand my mind. And this is what I think on a normal basis. Um how do I even know I'm alive? How do I even know that I'm dead? You know, I've been I've been through ups and downs, trials and tribulations. I've been through some craziness in my life, not too crazy as most people, but been through my fair share of life. So, so who am I in someone else's reality? Who am I? In, and, and whether, how do I know whether or not this reality is even mine? Or is, or is, 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 is my reality what it is? Am I, am I the center of this world or something? Uh, you know, I, I'm, I'm really, I'm just really saying, I'm really, I'm really just, talking crap right now because you know um i know i remember watching the truman show um back in the day 
Um, if anybody don't, if that, if anybody hasn't watched the Truman Show, and yeah, yeah, needs to go watch it because this, it, <laughs> I don't want to spoil the mu- movie, but the Truman Show depicted a, a person, a man, who lived his life, who he thought was a his real life. It was actually a movie. It was actually a show, I should say, not even not even a movie, a show. His his life was the show, but he didn't know it. So he kind of, kind of, he started kind of putting two, two and two together. Once he started to grow up, he started to put two and two together and like, whoa, okay, something's off. You know, he, he just thought he had such the perfect life, but he was just the center of the, of the world. He was the center of this world, obviously, of his world, the center of attention. He was the star. Yet everything around him was fake. His wife was fake. His his, the, the food, everything, the world, uh, the everything was around him was fake. His life was a show. So how do I know my life isn't that way right now? A, a dang show. A TV show, a movie, I don't know, a book. You know, just, just kind of, just makes you want to, you know, just makes you think like, man, you know, is this even real? Is everything out here real? You know, I ask these questions, man. Is everything out here is, I mean, what is real? What is fake? I mean, you know, is everything, everything I touch real? Is it real because I feel it? Is everything I read real because I feel it? Is everything I read facts because it's written down just because it's facts? Just because it's written down doesn't mean that it's facts, does it? Oh, it's factual because it's in a textbook. Is it, is it, is it real? Is it, is it factual because it's in a book or in a textbook or, or it's the truth in, in, you know, in someone's world, because it's the truth in someone's world, does it make it fact? Does it make it tangible? You know, things could be fake in my, in your world and it could be real in my world. But does it make it fact or factual? And what 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 it constitute facts anymore? What constitutes facts anymore? Because it's written, or is it, or it's it it has held an age. It's old. You know, that's the questions I could ask anyone. What makes me real? I mean, hey, because I because you, you 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 could touch me and I'm real. You know, I I may be something else in someone else's world, in someone else's reality. I mean, think of perception. You know, I I I know I know this from the past that um, if I don't talk to anyone, if I'm closed off and reserved, someone may perceive me as 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 high strung or you know or or nonchalant or saying they use that word in a negative light they perceive me as someone not nice because i am reserved and don't talk or don't say hi or anything like that right and then others may think that okay well he's just quiet you know so so it, perceptions perception is has a lot to do with it you know, we, we choose to believe in stuff. We, we don't choose to believe in things. Does that make anybody right or wrong in any sense? You know, you say, I don't think we're just right or wrong. I think everything is just is. Everything around us is just is. There, there, there may be no right. There may be no wrong, possibly. I know I've said in the past that things may be right may, and things that, there are things that are wrong. Based on perception, right? But how do we, how do we know that it, it is right or wrong? Maybe it maybe it's just is. You know, my perception may perceive things to be right, and my perception may perceive uh, things to be wrong, based on my perception, my culture, whatever, my world. But in someone else's world, it, it might be the opposite, the total opposite. On perception, of course, but 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 maybe it's just what it is. It is what it is. This is what you, everything we see around here is what it is. Every single thing. 
you know, things are going to happen. Bad things are going to happen. Good things are going to happen. It, it is what it is. It's going to be what it's going to be. The Bible talks about God. He is what he is. I am that I am. According, according to the name, of course, you know, you know, the Bible has God. God has many different names for some odd reason. Many different names in the Bible it makes you feel like he got he, he he's more than one one being. Yahweh, Elohim, Jehovah, Yah, Yah, Yahshua, or, you know, Yahuwah, Jesus in some sense. I, you know, even then I got to say, you know, it is what it is. We got different names, so what? I call him, I call him, you know, we call him God. I call him creator, creator God. You know, it is what it is. Let's keep let's keep going, you know. Let's keep moving. We 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 in this together, you know. And we gotta progress life. We gotta continue life. If this is even life itself, maybe the true life is when we go to sleep. You know, in our in our sleep, we 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 are fulfilling all of our dreams, right? <laughs> we are living our dreams in our dreams when we sleep. So it's probably best to go to sleep. <laughs> I could be rich when I sleep, you know, but, oh, but waking up to this figment world, it's just like, you know, you try to, you try to, you try to achieve these dreams in this figment world when it's, in, you know, sometimes it may be so impossible in a sense, you, you getting pushback, you're getting walls put up, you're getting firewalls put up in, in your way. It's like, you have to struggle. And fight to gain these things that that you dream up, but maybe your dream is what's real. You know, maybe maybe what's real is is when you go to sleep and you know you're living out your dream. Maybe that's what it is. Hey, I don't know. I don't know. You know, these are things I think about. You know, I don't know. I don't know. I think that's all I got to say. That's the recording. If you guys and girls made it this far, press that like button. And don't forget to subscribe to the channel. If you're watching this on my Facebook page, take the time to subscribe to my YouTube page at Notice TV. That's all caps, N-O-T-I-C-E-T-V. I'll catch you later and may God bless you.